is masturbation a sin? Well, it's one of those um, no but answers. So you've got um, the masturbation in Genesis there. Uh, spilling seed. That's more to do with pulling out before getting someone pregnant. Uh, second passage. Uh, masturbation Jesus speaks of lustful thoughts which might be a bit more along the lines of it but uh, if your right hand causes you to sin cut it off but uh, that, that passage is referring to masturbation <coughs> um, but it, yeah it gives you a rundown on what marriage is each man should have a sexual relation with his own wife and each woman with her own husband uh, the husband should fulfill the marital duties to his wife and likewise the wife to her husband. The wife does not have authority over her own body but yields it to her husband. In the same way the husband does not have authority over his own body but yields it to his wife. Do not deprive each other except perhaps by mutual consent and for a time so that you may devote yourselves to prayer. Then come together again so that Satan will not tempt you because of your lack of self-control. So, which is probably another part of masturbation. Um, so yeah, they, thinking about your wife and if you're away or whatever and thinking about your wife and that masturbation, I'm sure that's not a sin. It's, it, and that's the um, emphasis on thinking about. So it's your thoughts it's the thoughts that's the issue it's not so much the act it's uh, what you're thinking about while you're doing that um, you'll see like with um, I suppose single people on that um, your thoughts start you you've, you know you'll say well I don't think about the same woman twice which is you know worse um, and you, you start getting stronger and you need to think about more stronger and stronger things which aren't usually nice things and get rougher and rougher and all that sort of stuff so um, over time you, your thoughts you know get way worse and more more and more corrupt um, through those sort of things so that's where the masturbation gets you in trouble is um, thinking of things outside of marriage as well and um, and that sort of thing so you know, after a while, pleasing yourself is, is just the wrong path to take, take. So you shouldn't be pleasing yourself constantly all the time. It's just going to get you in trouble. <laughs> yeah, and, and you, your thoughts, that's the thing, the hard bit. You can't let corruption get into your mind. Um, you know, it's the whole thing about innocence. You're quite happy when you're innocent. You don't know about stuff and, until somebody comes along and you know, tells you about Lotto, how you can, if you buy this piece of paper, you've got a chance you can win millions of dollars, and then you start thinking, you know, in your thoughts, what it would be like to have this millions of dollars, so you go and get this Lotto ticket, and 20 years later, you're still getting that Lotto ticket. So, uh, yeah, it just comes down to keeping thoughts out of your head that shouldn't be in there and trying to stay innocent, even though you're not, you know what, what that stuff is. That's pretty much why we've got to go through these things so we can throw them off through our life and um, combat them and stop doing them because we know they're, you know, they're taking away from us. So, um, yeah, that's my view on masturbation. Alright, God bless.